was to experience through a game the 1979 Iranian Revolution. We let one of its creators explain this installation in her own words. 1979 Revolution is a video game based on the true events of the Iranian Revolution. The game allows people to have an immersive experience in the 1979 Revolution and as an audience member you, are, you put yourself in the shoes of someone who was actually living during those times. Ugh! He's cut pretty bad. You need to stop the bleeding. Within the gameplay, there's a number of different narrative choices. You're really forced to dig deep within yourself and, and put yourself in the shoes of that experience and decide what choices to make. So they can be as critical as life or death choices or um, selling out a friend or the option of your own safety. I hope you have found our accommodations to your liking, Mr. Shirazi. It is not often we get to show our hospitality to the hero of the revolution. Our mission is first and foremost to create an entertaining experience because we feel like education can become a dirty word. We believe that we can have the most impact by really creating an entertaining experience with substance and meaningful choices. Some people who may think that um, we are trivializing the Iranian Revolution through creating a game experience are misunderstanding because the, the definition of game is really starting to expand and what we're really using the word game here is to signify interactivity and how better to really drive home an experience, especially something that's very serious and very sensitive, than by using something that's interactive where you yourself have agency within that experience. The Iranian Revolution can be a very divisive topic for people. Either they associate with it or not, or they've taken some sort of political stance. So from the surface, people may think that it might be a tricky topic for um, audiences, but in fact, it's not at all. What we're representing here is a personal journey and people's true stories, and we're designing the content so you connect with that. So general audiences, it's, we're dealing with universal stories here. about being here at Sundance is it shows that to accept games and essentially what 1979 revolution is is it's a narrative story just like cinema or any other form of art so um, the focus here is on storytelling and using different mediums to explore storytelling there is an Iran on the horizon my friends and it is a glorious shining Iran